Balance decrees between November 30th, 2022, January 31st, 2023, your U.S. Department of Education, the jail student loan account balance decreased by 14,030 to from 14,030 to zero. 14,000 was the balance of going to school. So, bro, good work. It looks like you paid down. Biden, 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 Biden. Do my three party, my friends. Sip on this girl, I like tequila. Damn, this shit tasty. checking my credit score right that's what, that's <laughs> whatever what, that's what a black man gotta do hold on wait wait wait, wait. <laughs> every day of his so, life wait every look this is what it says right u.s department of education jail account balance decreased right jail? between jail? november 30th jail. 2022 wait, wait, wait. can you go back for GL, GL, gl 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 so it says between november 30th 2022 and january 31st 2023 your u.s department of education gl student loan account balance decreased from fourteen thousand thirty dollars to zero. DC Good. Wait, wait, wait. Here's a kicker. Good work. It looks like you paid down your balance. Lowering your total debt can have a positive impact on your score. Yo, DC. Yeah. Well, I ain't pay these niggas shit. What are they talking oh, about, bro? God. I don't know what they're talking hey, about. Hey, hey, hey. Wait, guess what? You know what you do? You know what you do? Know? What? You know, you know what you do now? What? Who you vote for next year? Yes, I am! <laughs> I'm joking. I don't vote. I would love it. I would love it. Son. I would love if this podcast came out and then, like, so guy in the credit bureau listened to this, <laughs> and it was like, oh, we fucked, up, we fucked up, we fucked up, we fucked up. Biden called into the wrong account. Uh, we, <laughs> yo, can you snitch on yourself just now? Oh. Not, I pay you, yo, you, know, I said, <laughs> yo, you didn't say that part, bro. You didn't have to say you ain't pay shit. So, you yeah. said I paid some. <laughs> are, you, are you mad at I ain't paid these motherfuckers in years. I, I, <laughs> by the way, that's why they erased it. They're like, he wasn't paying it anyways. Imagine, yo, yo, you just gave me <laughs> And we can't even, we can't, this, there's no hope. And this nigga paid it back, bro. <laughs> let's just take it away. <laughs> Jesus, no, bro. Actually, let's, let's, you got still know us? Oh, you went to the military, no. I do. Oh, you do? I do. You got still know us, Can I tell you what happened? Nah, Rich Dad. Can I tell you what happened? <laughs> did you do paper, paper school or? Um, you yeah, only went for like a semester, though. Like two? Yeah, I, I, Smart just, guy, just like me. No, I swear. <laughs> yeah. like, you only went for two semesters? Like, One, bro. And you, 14,000? That's why right. school was fucking, it was 12 grand that loan to go to that school, bro. Wait, what? It was twelve grand for me for, to go one, to semester? for one semester. I was going to pay twenty four thousand a year. I haven't cost my father like twenty five hundred. He probably. <laughs> oh, your dad must he probably. Like, oh, just oh no, maybe like five grand. You know, I think it was like twenty five hundred, like plus the lab. Maybe like a, and... yeah. So like, I mean, listen. You like, went to community first, then university. I went. To, right? I went to community. Yeah. yeah, and then I was in line to like go to university, mm -hmm. and then I was bro. I, I, said this, I think I said the story before. I was just, at one point, was failing uh, two classes, and I was just driving to school, pretending to go to school. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then I would just go, sit in the parking lot, cry, wait for my homie <clears throat> to come through. And I'm an emotional person, bro. I wouldn't you know, imagine, cry, I would just sit yo, there and listen to like imagine, music. Can you imagine somebody pulling up to the parking lot? Damn, this one's supposed to be hard for this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> by, the way, bro, by the way, bro, there was 100% of the time, I was sitting there, just like, not like, again, when I say cry, I mean, like, literally just sitting there, like, just depressed. Like, yeah. just kind of, like, yeah. in there. Like, maybe watery-eyed, like, a couple times. Not, like, I like to not imagine like, Not, like, white girl crying, crying. yeah. <laughs> I like to imagine you. Ah! 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 That's good. So, I'm, so, so I'm crying. Screwed. But there's definitely a time, like, a, uh, people would walk by, and uh, they would just, because, like, you parking lot, I'd just park in the parking lot. And they'd walk by, and I could just be sitting there, and you could just, I've seen it before, where you just see someone sitting in the car. Mm -hmm. Contemplating life, mm -hmm. and eventually you just like. But there's been times I've been walking, you see that same person. I'll be in my class looking out the window, and you'll just see that car pull out and leave, and you're like, that person dropped yeah, out. That, that person they dropped, dropped out. out. <laughs> yeah, that person dropped out. He just reversed out the parking lot. Yo, when did you, wait, no, 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 so I when did you? When did you go? I gotta stop coming to the parking lot. I could be anywhere right now. When I convinced my, when <laughs> and I, I decided yeah. that I'm gonna like stop <laughs> school. My I'm other <clears throat> school. When, uh, That's very uh, true. <laughs> when my other friends started failing too, and then oh, you need a companionship and failure. 
<laughs> why, 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 they do say Misery Loves Company. Misery Loves Company. Why did be y'all here? <laughs> Fail Army. <that> <laughs> um, let, uh, I think they already had that the copyright. Um, so, um, me and him. We're like the Chinese. We steal. <laughs> we steal. <laughs> we we steal and send balloons. Yo, yeah. Chinese is not algorithm friendly. <laughs> Stop saying it. China. China. <laughs> <laughs> if you say it in his voice, they're going to flag you, bro. Um, so, no, I would just wait for him. And then eventually he started, like, uh, failing. You were waiting for him to fail. <laughs> I was waiting for my friend to fail. And Lord, he needed two more weeks. Hey, so, he needed two more weeks. Hey, yo, yo. We, so we he's, two birds, baby. We flocked together. So, he, so that started happening. And then he started um, yeah. selling weed and doing, uh, <laughs> the tail. And doing Bitcoin. No, you Jesus lying. Christ, bro. Also, he made some money. He might be a millionaire right now. Oh, oh buddy, he gets good. Oh, buddy? He doesn't want to turn my phone calls anymore. Why? Not because he's down, because he up. He up, up. Oh, he up, up. Yo, hit him up right now on the pod. Awesome. <laughs> be like, yo, remember when That's he hurt my heart. Yo, oh, did he tell you to invest? He did, right? Um, I had some friends tell me to invest in Bitcoin when it first came out. <laughs> you know, no, 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 no. But I thought it was, can, can I be real with you? I can't blame him, though. There needs to be an education uh, to people like it's not that hard to invest your money I thought it was a whole process I gotta sign paperwork and shit by the way I'm lying he's done I mean you do if it's it's worth if the investment is worth something no well your homie's like yo invest but you're like yo bro but we're roommates though yeah, but, but, <laughs> like, but we're still roommates. No, so uh, <laughs> like, you didn't move out and like, yo, like, you I can't blame him though. It's hard to roll someone's weed and while they're telling you to invest, and you're rolling his weed, being like, you're an idiot, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is true. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? I, I do. I felt dumb sometimes, but I've also had some. I had this one smart dude in high school tell me in high school tell me to invest in Bitcoin, and he was like, "Can I donate? I'm also investing in certain airlines to fail." And then, uh, because, you know, you could bet against companies uh, and stuff, sure. right? You, bet a bunch you can of money short a company money. or whatever, right? And um, every company DC works for a short. Bro, honestly, to this day, this guy feels like an imaginary friend because if you ask me his name, I don't know it. I forgot another dude's name. That's interesting. And then if you ask me his Facebook, he don't have one, right? Like, like yeah, he's, my, yeah, he, I'm, he, I bet you he's a multi, multi, multi millionaire right now. This dude was on it. In the tenth grade, he was like, "This dude's looking for Kev's number in his phone, trying to figure out if he should do stand-up <clears throat> comedy right now." And I will tell him, "Yes, <laughs> I'll train you." <laughs> ten thousand a week. Ten thousand. I don't understand. A, mil- a million. No, no. Just yeah, buy my course. Man. You want to make it a stand-up comedy? Buy Kevin Sanchez's course for just four hundred ninety-nine. No, I, will, I would do the most fire stand-up comedy course. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, my first rule of business is like, "Yo, just come up here and do five minutes." Mm-hmm. Then after that, I'd be like, "Now, nah, do you guys feel how trash I was?" <laughs> your your, uh, your brother, your your older brother, or younger brother, did stand up for the first. My time. little brother, yeah, your little brother. How did you just got that? Did you see him? That was so cool, bro, to see. Cause like, first of all, I, I think my brother's way funnier than me. He's so annoying, though. I, I think know. every great comic, like, you're not the funniest person around you. My, yeah, my brother was sense. definitely the funniest. Everyone thought my brother was so funny, and I, I thought which one? Was funny. No, no, the older one, the oldest one. Let me tell you how funny. Funny, was. wild, just degenerate comedy. You know what I mean? Like just my, all this the how time. funny Rocky is. Yeah. my little brother Barack's, as the streets call him. Barack's. Rocky's so funny. He does jokes just for himself oh, in yeah. public. <laughs> like what? Like when we went to Popeyes. I ever say the story? We went to Popeyes with DC. <laughs> And it With was DC, huh? Okay. It was the uh, day right, after we the, the, the day of Napoleon, the day. and he saw a chicken sandwich. By the way, chicken sandwich was trash. But go ahead. Um, just want to bring that up. I don't know. Yeah. So okay, sure. it was the day yeah. that Rocky went to doped up uh, the comedy okay. club when we had him in, in Greenpoint, and we went to Popeyes, and um, there was this person behind the counter. I couldn't tell what sex she was. <laughs> I know that she identified as a woman, right? But I couldn't tell. Where she was born, right? She was a she was a quarter standing up. Yes. Yeah. You know so I don't even know what that means. You know where it landed. You know where. Yeah, yeah. I don't know where it can land. Yeah, it's a flip of the coin. Flip of the coin. Right? Because you know she she was clearly from a country. I mean, her parents were clearly from a different country, so she got a little stash on her. <laughs> right? She had a little stash on her. Mm-hmm. Right? So like, and she had a deeper voice, but not, and she had little titties, but you couldn't. And five o'clock shadow. Mm-hmm. But she no, no five o'clock shadow. But, and, but she was skinny, and, nah, but her shoulders weren't broad. 
but how just look at her elbows. I couldn't see, I wasn't paying attention to her. So anyway, she had these beautiful, she had beautiful long hairs and long nails, right? And uh, I ordered my Popeyes and then Rocky goes up and he goes, can I get a, can I get a, a Popeye's chicken sandwich? Real. Cheese. <laughs> real. <laughs> French fries. Why is it real? And I'm like, I'm look, I'm like, why did he do that? And then he turns around. He's talking in a voice. He, he's talking in a deep voice. And he turns around and he goes, he's laughing. But he's not laughing and looking at me. He's laughing and looking at the floor. And <laughs> I'm like, why did you do it? He goes, you heard me? <laughs> he goes, I was making fun of her, her deep voice. <laughs> but he didn't do that for nobody but himself. That's right? funny shit. And I think that that's what makes him hilarious. Like, I remember when he was a kid, um, my godmother, she's just one of these women that yell at kids. <laughs> Anyone's kids. Anyone's yeah. kids. I don't fuck with them. Yeah, yeah. Yo, bro, she was so fucking funny. Yo. We would knock on the door, right? Because uh, my brother, my godbrother lived up there. We go there almost every weekend. We would knock on the door, and she goes, Hi! <laughs> what? <laughs> bro, she would go, Hi! <laughs> I feel like Spanish mothers are either the best mother uh -huh. or the worst. No, no, she, mother, she, 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 no. Like a good mother. And I'm saying, like, I meant more like they do it with either a smile or they do it either with Either they hatred. love kids around or they hate kids around. Yeah, because like I had like a Dominican mother who, bro, that was like my second mother at yeah. one point. Like, I, like, like go back. Like, I, I, was, I even go back. Like, Ellie Angel, you're my dog, but I go out to see your mom to see how yeah, she's sometimes okay. Sometimes it's like that. You know? I'm like, I want to make sure she's okay mentally. You know, yeah, we know who you are, bro. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, you're good. You got your girl and everything, but she, she got to get, get hugged. So, so um, my godmother, like, she would do, and my brother hates stuff like that, right? Because he goes, y'all, I want, my brother's like, I'm a person. My brother's all about respect. Mm -hmm. So he's like, okay. if you if you treat me like you don't want me there, I don't need to be there. Right. But the thing is, like, we were all there, so... So Yeah, I wouldn't have nowhere to go either. Yeah, we didn't really have nowhere to go. So he's like, alright. So he'll go, she will do that, she will open the door, and he will go, oh. <laughs> 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 yeah. I ain't calling you on that That's not funny, bro. You just do that at this as as soon as he opened How the door. How old was he when he did that? How old was he? Oh, my Yo, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yo, for him to like. What's her reaction like? Yo, don't look at me like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't look at me like that. For him Respect. to like internalize the, with the ability to like, this, all right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to be mad sarcastic every Yo, time we go to her house so, at, at 12. Come on, I swear to God, you whatever. It's going to be so fucking funny, bro. So then one time, because you know what we're like, it, it's like. We're playing video games, bro, and we're, <laughs> kid, we're kids from New York. We're mad loud. Yeah. yeah. Right? Okay. And all my godmother wants to do is lay in bed, read erotica, and I play. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo. Those exotic novels? Bro. Yeah, exotic exotic novels. Novels. Exotic She would come novels. home, make amazing food, give everyone like a kiss on the head, not me, obviously. And, and but, just like, want to be <laughs> sitting reading with a uh, pussy. And then, yeah, she should be like, I'm going to my room. Everyone, leave me the fuck uh, alone. alone. <laughs> yeah, so... I yo Rocky and so, <laughs> so Barack's we loud and she comes in. You guys are making too much noise, too much noise. You don't make that much noise when you go downstairs to your mother's house. And Rocky goes, he'll say, I don't even know what he'll say. She, we start, uh, we were like Rocky, chill, and then he'll just in her face, she's in front of him, just go. <laughs> <laughs> like what? And then, like pretending, like he's talking. Like, yeah. No, no, no. Not even talking. Pretending that if she, if he holds his hand in front of his face and turns around and, and starts laughing, she she won't see it. And then she will go. I can see you laughing. And then now we start laughing. Everybody laughing. Stop laughing at me. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I felt, I mean, you had to go back to the next day. He was a, like, every day. Humor wise, he was a clever kid. Like, he was like 12. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking That's what funny, I mean, yeah. The story he used to, I can't even remember. Yo, what's I mean, it like having, so I'm the youngest, so, but like, what, I don't have, and obviously, any siblings younger than me. I only have, like, step siblings who are like, say that again, bro, you mumbled it. I'm the, I'm the youngest. Mm -hmm. I only have step siblings, and. That are younger than you. No, the, the, uh, the youngest is like five months younger than me. So it's like, it, we're the same age. So like, What's it like having a younger brother that, like, you, not like you can't control, but, like, 
Because, like, for me, like, my older brother, like, he says, like, I don't know if he says something, like, like, I feel like I respect, like, we five. There's also a point in our life where my brother would be like, yo, like, listen. Like, I guess I never had to rebel, but, like, is it annoying him, that little brother, where he's like, yo, bro, chill? Um, or is it, was it mad just entertaining? Well, for me, it was a little different. Because I was grown, like, because I, my mom, she was raising three boys who technically weren't her own. Right? Mm. So, oh, yeah, y'all all adopted. We're all adopted. Nobody wanted you niggas. It's so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you tell you. That's what it feel like. No, no, no. no. <laughs> well, well I, have to, I have to preface it that way. Yeah. My mom took very good care of us. Yeah, yeah. You know what's crazy about this podcast? <laughs> Two parents, one parents, no parents. <laughs> no, but all the parents still, still <laughs> somehow. Nah, my mom, my mom, the person that raised me is my, my, is my that's my mother. That's my, she's my parent. Neat. Um, but your guardian. No, 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 she adopted no, 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 us. She adopted no. us. So she legally adopted us. Now, mm. now fake she... ass parents. She gonna drop me off to my fake ass grandma. I <laughs> 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 get watched by my fake ass auntie. <laughs> yo, bro, that's what. Yo, bro, that's no, what. Yo, it was also eating all four. That's why I hate it. Like nothing Christmas. real in this house. No. That's why you hate it. Yeah, exactly. That's why you hated Christmas. I hated Christmas because like these aunties would come and kiss me on the lips. I'm like, yo, bro, <laughs> no way. Hey, you I remember. Like, so you would, when, when you look in the back of your head like this is not wouldn't this be and better than nah because they were ugly bro <laughs> I'll be looking at my cousin who who not really my, my fake cousin I'm like yo why can't she kiss me on the lips why gotta be you <laughs> wait all your titis were like, all of them not all listen listen, <laughs> listen. no your titis had tatas Yes, I like it. Nah, old. these were older. <laughs> listen, I call them titis and aunties because mm. I didn't. They weren't. They weren't. First of all, they were not even that for me, for real, for real. Yeah. But they weren't even aunties to the people that were uh, like. I don't know who these women were. They was just fat aunties, if you will. <laughs> Yo, Yo, fat up. women in the neighborhood. <laughs> it was just. They would just leave me with fat women all the time. Bro. <laughs> and they had mustaches and moles. <laughs> And so these bitches would like really like give me these wet ass kisses, bro. Mm-hmm. Like these wet lip kiss, and I'm like, yo, the, like, I will cry. I don't want to say hello. I don't want to say. It. And then my mom. What was, your, what was your first Christmas like? It was sad. It was. I remember it to this day, bro. Oh. I. So it's Christmas, and my mom's like, it's weird because I. I, this is interesting. I never told this story. So, because I don't remember it, but I remember it. Okay. And I don't know how to explain this to you, but I got out of, I was, the month of December is when I was taken away from my home. Okay. It, early December. Okay. Or December 20, it could be December 21st. Really? Yeah. Well, that was the first time, around that, time. That, or that so day. your first Christmas. So, that's basically, the first Christmas like, I remember was I was just taken away from my biological family's home. Oh, wow. Wow, I didn't even know that, bro. Wait, wait. You, uh, sorry, have you, with your own eyes, have you seen your parents? Yeah. My mom, not my dad. My dad didn't know I existed until I was 25. You talked to him? Uh, not really. It was through different channels. But then I punked out on me when I was 25. Why? Because I didn't feel like, because I heard that he had some money, and I was like, and he had a lot of children. And I'm likable. Mm-hmm. So I was like, this dude's going to fall in love with me, hand me everything, and then 25 other children are going to want to kill me. So, <laughs> that's how, no, honestly, I just didn't want Kev, I, give, I, him, give him a call right now. We need money. Yeah. <laughs> I like he said we. <laughs> <laughs> Podcast needs budgeting. Um, but, um, um, so first my, Christmas, you my, get adopted. So wait. No, I don't get adopted. I'm in foster care. So wait. Damn. Wait a minute, but your own, like your own, but you saw your mom. Did she drop you off at foster care? Like foster? <laughs> so that works. No, the cops came and got us. Oh wow! Uh, like oh, like services. Yeah, came. yeah, child services. My mom didn't drop me off at a fire department. Was like, what was Do that something for? Like? With this. Do something with this. Um, put it out. Put it out. Uh, <laughs> So, but Ross goes. So the shit piece is gonna get rid of us. <gasps> oh, that's you would do that shit too. No. <laughs> Yo, by the way, <laughs> now I know why you guys got put for adoption. It's Bar- it's Barack's. Yo, I have a weird memory from Barack's that's clearly not real. It's not real. Hey, what did you say that again? I have a memory, a clear memory that's not real about Barack's. Okay. When he came from the hospital as a newborn. 
I was in my, my the woman who adopted me home and they put him in the carriage and I swear to everything I love I saw his spirit right and it was this he was in bed and I'm looking like man that's my little baby brother he was just born and my, I'm filled with love and and, 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 and I'm crying because I'm like yo what are we going to do I don't even know if we're going to be here you know like for too long you, you can feel it no, I'm talking about be here, like in this apartment. I don't know if we're gonna get put back up for foster, like for like go to be in different foster homes, right? I I, I wasn't legally adopted yet. But at that point, you're out of foster care. I mean, my mom, the person that adopted me, is home, but it's not a guarantee I'm gonna be there. Okay. And I swear to God, I'm laying there, and I swear to everything I love, bro. Rocky goes <laughs> just like that. That's what I remember. <laughs> Did he freak you out? <laughs> Bro, I I think I started crying and laughing at the same time. <laughs> Yo, he, he, he went, bad, and, then, and then he went, PJ. <laughs> <laughs> that asked me sad. No, that's the other, yeah. um, um, but my first Christmas, I remember, like... So you get adopted. I'm not adopted. You keep saying ado adopted. Foster care is waiting for adoption. Yeah, yeah. You're waiting for adoption. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry. So Well, at the time, it's not... I'm waiting for my mom to get better. Mm. They gave my mom four years to get better. She was on drugs and she was an alcoholic. You know and where she, she like lived? In she home? lived. Uh, I went there. Re I went there a few years ago. Really? Yeah, I went back there because uh, they still have that apartment. It's like a three bedroom apartment, and ninety Dominicans live there. Damn. You know, like I right, so it's a regular Dominicans. Dominican apartment. It's a regular Dominican <laughs> yo, apartment. Yo, you, you need to write "Hey Arnold," but all Dominicans. All Domin oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so funny. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, oh, the intro, the intro of that of that show should just be twelve songs playing over <laughs> each other from different rooms. <laughs> no, 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 they don't do that in Dominican households, bro. That, you that's, that's, run. Run. that's really fun. No, that's there, funny. That's there really will funny. be some sixty-five year olds with their own chairs sitting in the front. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. It's just a bunch of music playing with and the then just all coming. Mm -hmm. so, and you kids don't make that loud in my house. You know, you know that loud. You go down to your mom's house and just. And it's just Dominican. And he's a super, <laughs> so he got the biggest apartment for yeah. a good price. Nah, there was no super. I don't know what you're talking about. But no, I'm saying when you talking about yeah, this yeah. <laughs> So, um, my first Christmas, I remember my first Christmas and with my your second current, Christmas your mother, with, with your my mother. mom. That's what I'm saying. You yeah. got, you, but you got adopted when you're with her. I don't know how to explain this to you, bro. She's oh. a foster mother. I do. It's all right. I'm sorry. She's a foster parent. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. She was, but she kept you guys. She ended up keeping us, yeah. Yes, okay, yeah. I get it. She, she, I, I, I really don't mean this in the worst way. I, I, I mean this with all wholeheartedly. I had to go Dylan. Think about, like, puppies. Like, how, did that, how would yeah. that work? Yeah, I was going to tell you. I, I'm, sorry. Gonna I, tell you. I, I'm no, that's fine. Um, but, yeah, okay, so she ended up keeping us. So you're at, you're at a foster's care. Yeah, I'm, like, 10 days there. And one of the things I think that was taught to my mom as a foster parent was if you're not planning on adopting these kids, you can't overly love them because it makes it really really hard for them to their life might be going from home to home to home until they're 18 19 20 years old Jesus. so Jesus. do you know people like that like friends or anything or not? i don't talk to these losers you know <laughs> yo kev even at like a 10 year old go, yo, kev, that's why i love kevin his confidence he'd go home from home to home getting foster care because i'm the best on the planet i'm, the I'm, the, I'm number I'm one i'm a gift to you guys <laughs> yo, kevin walk in and go you're welcome <laughs> by the way that's the only reason that you didn't care about christmas because you just every christmas you'd be like guys i am the gift i mean i'm here and I keep on giving. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a gift to keep on. So your mom adopts. So, so your mom. So I'm mom, in, sorry, sorry, sorry. You go to your mom's house. I'm, I'm in my my for, Let's call her uh, at the time. At the time, foster mother. mother. Thank you so much. Right. So at I'm the time, my foster at the time foster mother. This is uh, another foster mother. But okay. she's a BM. This is before mother. Right. So. <laughs> <laughs> not baby mother before mother. By the okay. way, did you ever walk into that house and be like, when you like, when you're like, even like a foster parent, like, how can she be a foster? How, like, how can like, how can be a foster parent? But she's was there two parents in the household? So a foster parent, do you know what that is? So a foster parent is a person that accepts children mm -hmm. into their home mm -hmm. as a placement mm -hmm. until they can find either a permanent home mm -hmm. or they can like. I, was just always just, I guess I always just seem like TV was like one big house. 
Some places are like that. I, I guess I was in Florida. We, um, on the, I, I knew a dude I played football with. Um, he like, lived like his foster parents were driving there. Mm-hmm. It was like they lived in all one big house. Yeah. So some places are like that, but it, this is New York City. It's a concrete jungle. You're right. You're right. You're so right. So some places. So thinking. you you are thinking. You're thinking. You just don't. You're not aware. I'm not of aware. Like yeah. So city life. First Christmas, bro. I'm thinking it's about to be popping. Right? What? what was that? That was a heartbeat. That was, that was, that was a story. <laughs> bro, because all, do, do, do. they did um, all their shopping like in one or two days for the rest of the kids. There were more kids in the house? They're not for the foster kids, like their actual family kids. Your mom has real kids. She does. She has two daughters who were like 27 at the time, and they had kids. So she already has. So, like, there, I see all the Toys R Us gifts coming in. And I'm like, yo, son, did I just luck out? Let's go. Bro, on Christmas Day, they realized no one got us, got me a gift. And it's not their fault. They're just not thinking. They're only thinking about their lives, you know? Yeah. As an adult, I know that now. Uh, And then they just, like, took, uh, I don't know if you guys remember this, but they used to have these little miniature Indians and, um... Yes, toys yes. and then also the they, they didn't move or anything the yeah, guys. Just, and the yeah. army guys yeah. mm-hmm. they threw the Indians the army guys and they gave me I ain't gonna lie this really cool um the, oh my god I just had a memory this really cool um horse and buggy for the Indians oh, yeah. and then they took it away and decided that wasn't yours <laughs> uh, uh, no, we gave Jesus, you too much bro. we gave you too much yeah, oh my god so your mom like, went over and was like well, my mom, my mom, for a long time, it, I mean, years, really, I couldn't call her mom, even though I really wanted to. Who did you say, Lisa? I used to call her, her, her nickname was Tata. What's Tata? Just, uh, it's like Tatiana. somebody, th- no. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, but, <laughs> Tatiana. <laughs> nah, Tata is just like, uh, I don't know, I feel like that's a common, like, some late, some girl couldn't say margarita. <laughs> Guy, so the, the little girl, or one of her nieces, you couldn't say Margarita or Grandma or some shit like that. Is Margarita Grandma? No, Margarita's my mom's name. Is Margarita? Mm-hmm. Margarita. Yeah. Margarita. Like what? Like you call Margs? Yeah. Like, like two Margs. It's like like it's, it's, like the drink. Margarita. Like the drink. Exactly the they went right exactly. to the end of the word. Just, it's a ta. It's a ta. <laughs> yeah. Margarita. So they call it yeah. ta. So they call it ta. ta. <laughs> <laughs> what? I don't understand why this is blowing up. No, that's so funny. It is a little crazy to go right to the last two letters of the word. Margarita. <laughs> you can't say it? Just say Tata. No, ma- 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 ta- 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 it's just ta- ta- funny. Ta- 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 her name is Margarita. Yeah. <laughs> For sure, they call her Tata. Yeah, I don't, you it's know what's so crazy? crazy? Like, I was... Uh, it dawned on me recently that she has a... She's named... She's not named after a drink. My mom's one of the few people who were named before the drink. Yeah. Margarita. Margarita is a common name. Yeah, yeah. But Margarita was named after some bitch. It's a (laughs) pretty ass drink. Because it's bitter and sour. It'll fuck you up. (laughs) (laughs) Just like a Puerto Rican. (laughs) The white girls love it. Uh, So, so, so yeah, but the next Christmas, they, they, because like, when they realize. Tatiana. Tatiana. I don't know if it was the next Christmas, but it was, it was. Christmas uh, or next. There was a few Christmases I was like, oh, they're going out. They go on all, all in. Like, what'd you get? Bro, I had the bet. Bro, I had this the Batmobile. Oh, that's fire a fire toy. Out. That's a fire toy, bro. With Ooh. Batman, fire, bro. And they bought me the Superman toys. It was the black and silver Superman. Bro, I was balling like the out. The mid-size here. joints, the one that took the action figures that are like this big. Oh, yeah, yeah. I thought. Oh, we yeah. we need some sizes here. So the, this one wasn't that size. That's a bit. That's I don't know about. That's that. like the big action. That's like the action figure. Honestly, I don't remember what action. Yeah, yeah. Like the old not. Thing. I had a. I had the. Oh, grab it, DC. Grab one. You, you see. You see the. Don't gauntlet. be careful. You see the gauntlet. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna get super simple. No way. The gauntlet so size. I had a few action figures gauntlet this size. Yeah. Oh like, like no, no, no like not that size. big. Okay. Not that big. It was like mm-hmm. mid. Like the guy broke his leg though. Remember wrestling toys? Remember wrestling toys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, yeah. Gotcha, so gotcha. Like regular, like, like, like uh, yeah, like regular action yo, figures. Real quick, the whole thought. Don't forget, you ever went to a kid's house and you see wrestling toys and the arm is chewed the fuck up? 
<laughs> like you ever you remember those those kids? Yeah, I'm going to my mom. We gotta go. <laughs> TC, hey, to be hey, to be detective. Did he have a dog? Nah, no, that's no, the thing. No. They went in the Caribbean. They, they don't be having no dogs like that, bro. Like you just oh, go to this yeah. house. I'm like, yo, y'all kids just be fucking out toys. Like walking <laughs> around chewing them. Now I want cookies. You know what I mean? Like oh. that's shit. I only ever chewed my toys. Yeah, you probably, you probably. I'll, I'll tell you one of the funniest things that uh, ever happened was I had a friend, uh, uh, Tamer. And uh, we were good friends in uh, middle school, and um, he'd always like he started he just started coming over to the crib, and his home life I'm sure wasn't great. So I'm like my crib, like open space, we can do whatever the fuck we want, plenty of things to do, and homies, whatever. So he would always come over. He'd come over the weekends. We'd stay the entire weekend. He'd be hang out. And I remember um, one of the early times, like let's say, let's say I think it was, I don't say the first time we ever hung out. We're still trying to be cool, like yeah, bro. We love skating. Skating's our life. We love, we're 13 years old. We just started skateboarding. Like, mm-hmm. That year, bro. So, like, we hang but out. But I like when kids think like that. No, no. So, we're just skateboarding. We're, mm-hmm. like, that. we're doing that. And then we get inside. And we have the whole weekend to hang out. Mm-hmm. And I was, like, he's, like, yo, what's, like, that over there? I was, like, oh, it was, like, my buckets of toys. Like, I don't want to play with them anymore. He's, like, no. Nah. I'm, like, oh, no. And, bro, within, like, 30 minutes, it was just, like, it was us, like, in, like, I remember, like, in my dining room, like, he was, like, like, we, like, we, like, he went his separate way, I went my separate way, and we, like, made this whole storyline, I was, like, and we had, like, a meeting, and he was, like, I remember he took one of the trains that, like, my mom got me when I was a kid, and made it a bomb, what? and was, like, he, and we had like, this whole oh, meeting, like, 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 like as a joke, tr- like, as, like, yeah. a joke, and then he had it with him, and we, like, had, we're having this whole meeting of, That's like, an intricate plot, and we're playing yeah. it, bro, bro, and then, and then I said something, and I, like, I, like, won the argument, he goes, all right, well, guess what, I bought a bomb, and I was, like, I remember getting so angry. I was like, bro, I was like, my child, bro, you can't make that a bomb. It's not a bomb. <laughs> <laughs> and it was just funny. I, was like, I just remember I was sitting there, like, playing, and I was like, bro, we're, like, like, yeah. it was like I was like, oh, we're kids. Yeah, like, like why are we re fucking creating the Gaza Strip? Yeah, yeah, I remember that. that by the way, <laughs> by the way, we're 100% more. <laughs> <laughs> what are you stupid? Um, I want to, um, I want to, I think I want to adopt kids. Really? Like, yeah, I want to adopt kids. Ooh, one. Oh, that's a great, that's a great. Idea like also, are you gonna adopt? Are you gonna foster like one Chinese kid? I don't want. <laughs> I want two black kids of my own, and I just want. I want to adopt. Are you gonna adopt? Kid. It's interesting. Maybe yeah. I, I I would adopt a kid if I had a lot of money and uh, really? a life I loved. Yeah. If I had a life I love, <laughs> yeah. definitely if I have a life I love. Yeah. But if wife, like I see wife. that my life is regular, I'm still gonna adopt. Really? Okay. Yeah. Because you know crazy, y'all are. I never knew you had people with good hearts. Yeah, no, 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 that's it, that's it, that's it, that's why she wanted to fuck with you guys, because you're assholes like me, with good hearts. Yeah. Um, I never thought, I don't think I ever want to adopt, to be honest. I don't think mm-hmm. I want to That's fair, that's fair. Um, I never, never, I'm never, incredibly selfish of you, but like, no, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, no, wait, no, no, I'm kidding. It gets worse. It gets worse. Uh, I've only had the opposite thought. Mm-hmm. I would never adopt. I want to spread my, I want to spread my seed. Like that doctor. <laughs> Not like him. But, yeah. I remember there was a point where there was like they like there's a cult there's a, if you guys don't know there's a doctor that like uh in um on like it's a Netflix special he like but he put his semen in the girls and like they they came to get pregnant yeah. and he was just doing it himself so he can have as many he children was a as fertility possible. doctor it was very fucked up not okay but <laughs> I could understand like because I'm dating a woman who's not Jewish I'm yeah. like I'm I believe I'm a pretty handsome Jewish guy mm-hmm. I want there to be more handsome Jews. Right. It's not enough. You can't adopt it's not a enough Jewish good-looking Jew. Kid, adopting a Jew. What if a Jewish kid can adopt? That kid already exists. I think that's only. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You can't make him handsome. We I need, guess. No, no, no. Yeah. We need to make more Jews. Yeah, yeah. We need the numbers to be more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I've always had the thought. I think I always want to keep donating. Like every year, donate a hell of a bunch of sperm to like Israel or something. But Israel don't need your sperm. They got so, good looking Jews. Wait, how, wait, I'm tall. You need I'm here. handsome. You need imagine, imagine an army of me. Yeah, but you need them They here. complain the entire time, but they get the fucking job done. Yeah, but like, you need them in Brooklyn. In Israel, they got the they got the yeah, hard hitting yeah, Jews. They got the, the problem they got, is yeah. that they don't put in a Jewish woman. It's pointless. Hey, no, bro. you could. You could, you could <laughs> <laughs> this guy's like a black panther that has a white girlfriend, bro. <laughs> this guy's talking about he could just be with a Jewish girl, make a handsome Jewish kid, and but instead he's like, but I'm not with one, so I'm gonna donate my sperm to Israel so they can make more of me. Yeah, but you could donate to like a, a black power. <laughs> you could donate to a Jewish fertility clinic. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. In New York, mm. where it goes, to, you could ask. I would do that like tomorrow. Ask Sarah. Sarah knows. Oh, you yeah, yeah, you can hit her up. Uh, 
Uh, <laughs> Sarah, over your sperm is like a funny, weird thing. <laughs> I'm just saying. Talking about sperm, dude. Sarah, I'll do it. bro. <laughs> she knows what she can do with your sperm. Uh, go, go watch our episode. I, I won't be Sarah. a foster Everyone. parent because I think you need to dedicate your life to that. Um, it's different. And your kids usually hate the other foster kids because Donald Glover grew up like that. His, his parents were foster parents. Yeah? So there's always new kids in and You're out right. of his house all the time growing up. Too many kids. So he was like, he was like, I almost felt like I was a foster there was, kid. You know what's yeah, crazy? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you want to hear something? I just remember. Oh, it's easy. I think it's easier for a foster kid to be like, I'm a part of the family than for the real kids to be like, yo, what the fuck? Yeah, that's they feel true. pushed out. You don't think so? That's not true. I felt, I would, I would I, me, one time me and my, me and my uh, brother and my sister. <laughs> How would I know? How would you? Because you because you haven't been on the other end. Because I've witnessed them. No, bro. Yeah, okay. No, but Trust I, me, it's easier for them. Yeah? Okay. I, one time, I one time said to my dad, me and my brother and my sister were like, yo, we feel like the stepkids in this family. And my dad got real mad. Because you stepkids came in yeah. and you got, he started prioritizing them. Yeah. You know what's what funny? I think men do. I don't know if it's nature. It's men. They start making the woman happy. Whatever we're happy, but if you love that, she had three girls. But if he, if your dad loves her more, he's gonna take care of her children like they're his. You love. Sh- <laughs> you- <laughs> 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 I'm just saying. You don't even have a dad, bro. I'm just saying. You don't even like have a dad, though. I, bro. Fuck you, bro. He's like kind of deep. We're all working through our traumas on You don't even have a dad. No, he's wild, bro. He has a joke where he says that like he wishes mom had better pussy. He just told Dylan that, yo, I wish your mom also had better pussy. Yo, <laughs> yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo, mom's a shit pussy, raise your hands. Put <laughs> your hands up, Kevin. Her mom got banger pussy. Her pussy was so banger, she's trying to get rid of children. <laughs> she, not only did she try, she succeeded. Oh, my she God, She succeeded bro. in getting rid of us. So she can go out there and fuck. <laughs> I bought mics now. You bought mics? Yo. It's the funniest. I made Tristan do it too. Like, so, you, wait, your mom that was white knuckling was your adopted mom? Yeah. Oh, got she you, got you. And that's why, that makes sense as to why they gave you to her in a sense. Wait, so, so tell me, Kev. They didn't know. When they, did, they when, when, when did, before. when did the, okay, so, as if it was like a, a meter. In the middle is, here's adopted, mm-hmm. here's not adopted. It's going like this. When is that pivot point? When's that day? Like, when do you go? I don't even know, bro. Like, when did you go? I think we live here. Guys. It's like not adopted, foster, 18? Yeah. Wait, what are you saying? Like, when did you say, oh, I think this is a permanent home? Oh, When okay. did permanent home day happen? So, did she come in and say, hey, guys, guess what? I love you. You're actually and your mom. Like, when uh, did she become mom? So, uh, it was, well, when we got adopted and when I felt like it was home is two different days. Right? When, when, uh, Which one came first? Oh, got on Ferragamo glasses? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I didn't know that. Continue. Yeah. <laughs> My bad. The worst. <laughs> uh, when, when Which one I, came first? When I was a uh, um, getting it. So yeah, well, no, we got legally adopted by her, but it, and it didn't fit because she was. My mom grew up without Google and Oprah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? Does? So she was a bad cook and stupid. No, no, no. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> damn son, this guy, bro. Boy, <laughs> to be DMing me about him, like, yo, bro, <laughs> check your white boy. <laughs> Yo, bro, you need me to smack your shit. I raised my hand and my mom had bad puss. And we'll, it's and, and we'll, it's all moms can get these I'm not, hands. I'm not, I'm not. Listen, bro, I'm not fucking. I'm, I'm saying not, not. all moms can get these hands. I'm saying it's bad. Like, all moms can get these hands. You're trying to figure my mom, dude? You're trying to figure my mom? All moms can get these hands, dude. Put your fucking finger down, dog. Um, My mom used to use this threat of putting us back up for adoption. Oh, yeah. That's so fucked up. Oh, that is weird. But. But that was a defense man because she also she's raising three Hellraisers. Yeah, you she's know? raising a dude who's going around all puppies going. Wait, I just want to see is this because I know it's an immigrant thing because Jamaicans will always threaten to send you back to Jamaica because they knew where hey, they hey, came from. You hey, we survive. all have immigrant parents. Here. Would they threaten to send you guys to Israel yeah, or, mom, or border? My mom was hilarious about that. Yeah, she goes. <laughs> my mom's like, I'm gonna send you back to Dominican Republic. Yeah, <laughs> because. You gotta be with the rest of the animals. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, bro. <laughs> Damn, bro. Your mom was yeah, wild, bro. You know, that's why, I like, I, I'm doing this joke now. Where I'm like, yo, it's wild that my biological mother gave me to the enemy. Yeah. And let me stay there. That's <laughs> Puerto more, Rican that, mom. Yeah, my Dominican mom. That's bars. No, okay. So your Dominican mom gave you to a Puerto Rican mom. Kind of, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah like, my mom, my, my biological mom should have saw that we were our foster parents Puerto Rican. Was like. Hold up. <laughs> Yo, you don't behave each other. Right? Yeah. Do they really hate each other? 
Yeah. They have a ri- rivalry. Why? Always in high rivalry. school. But Puerto Ricans think they're better than everybody because they're yeah. American, low key. Yeah, and Dominicans are more fun. Dominicans are way more fun, and they, oh, they, they, I, they I, do I, get I, real lot, you know. And they cook better. And this is nothing better food for sure. Not, not, not in my opinion, I'm Dominican, oh, but <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, they niggas. Dominicans are niggas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. don't say that. <laughs> 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 Yo, I, I wanna um, I get, get to the plugs, guys. Go follow I yeah, sure. comedy. We just went through all of Kev's childhood. Learn new yeah, shit about Kev yeah, every time I do this, bro. Remember? Okay. Guys, go follow at Dove Comedy. Go follow the Instagram. Um, you guys, go follow everything that we do. We have comedy shows coming up. If you're watching this right now, that means it's Sunday. If you're watching this on time on Sunday, that means tonight we have our opening back show. March 5th at the stand. It's sold out. But you can still come out and party. So if you're in New York, New Jersey, Philadelphia area, come hang out, come party. Uh, Of course, as always, go follow me at Villain J. Negri on everything. Um, And we just announced it. uh, Another Dope Dope Comedy show. We got March 9th and March 23rd at Con Body. That's Lower East Side, New York City. And uh, it's 25th. I've been telling people 23rd. Uh, <laughs> Comedians. <laughs> I've been fucked. I've been. I, there's, a, I, there's there's seven people booked for twenty third. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, bro. <laughs> this, I'm actually. I'm kind of around. I didn't text people now. <laughs> oh, my phone's there. Um, and then also, guys, we also just announced. Main room, uh-huh. the stand, uh-huh. 420. Uh-huh. We are the 420 show Let's at the go. stand. What is 420? You already know, but there's a main show there at the stand, 10 o'clock. It's going to be dope, dope comedy, 10 o'clock at the main Let's room go. stand. Hey, guys, go see us. Hey, Dylan, my bad. You were never wrong. It's March 23rd. This thing is a clown. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to yeah. for the 25th. He just went in on himself for being wrong. I've been both for the 25th. Three, four? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it sounds like we got a great life. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> um, all right, but yeah, guys, go double comedy. We're coming all over. The show's been doing great. Thank you guys so much for everything that's uh, been supporting. The Soul Out show upstairs has been amazing. By the time most of you guys hear this, we've already have done it probably. And that, I'm sure, went amazing. So you'll see posts of that go with our Instagram and clips coming from that and everything from, from there. Um, as Ooh. well, um, yeah, go please support 420 show. Kevin? Like, follow, I got a new Instagram name. Oh, it's so if you're Kevin Sanchez ENT. Can I tell you what I thought? Okay. I read it as yeah. Kevin Sanchez in it. <laughs> Fire. <laughs> Kevin Sanchez in it. Uh, Kevin Sanchez ENT. Kevin Sanchez in it. It's going to be Kevin Sanchez ENT on everything eventually. Yeah, it's going to be good We have to change it. Kevin Sanchez Enterprises. Yeah. Or entertainment. I know. You know, or Enterprises. <laughs> You know, and uh, yo, like he said, everything he said, please do follow for dope dog 420. We gotta sell that motherfucker out, so please come through. And uh, you know, the lineup's gonna be fire. Um, and plus, you got us three. I heard, I heard, we're slowly falling in love with who's it calling? Everyone watching, is that a young bull calling? Nah, it's probably gonna be like Kevin Sanchez. Follow me online at DC Williams Comedy. Please like, follow, subscribe, share, man. Keep sharing that, those clips. I appreciate you guys for doing that. Um, yeah, man, keep rocking with us. And come out 420 because it's going to be lit. And tomorrow night is going down at 9 p.m. The no, show's so- sold out. People are still trying to come. I no, told them to come. Up. And well, I don't know what's about to happen. So. Every, every, everyone that hits you up, everyone that can't get in the show, I go 420. Buy 420, buy a ticket right now. Facts, facts. Or so many of y'all line up outside and be like, yo, there's no more seats. Like, God damn, I guess we got to, how we going to bring them in? We got to give Doped Up a show every month or something, man. Listen, so, yeah, bro, man, love well, you guys. We, Listen, guys, come out to 420. Shout out to the stand, too. And, um, yeah, the stand, listen, it's, it's amazing work with that. This is a really uh, 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 awesome uh, venture. Uh, this has always been the dream. It's always been the dream of Doped Up, and um, I'm really happy to be there. Thank you, everyone that supports us. Also, if you're listening to this podcast and you want to buy a ticket, use code DOPE, D-O-P-E, all uh, capital letters and you'll get a percentage off your tickets mm. code dope and um, also while we're doing plugs let's not let's not even mess around let's get to the money zia farms guys go support zia farms z-e-h-e-h-e-m-p.com and we're going to tell you more than being another ad during the episode but uh zia farms has some big things coming we're actually going a big show it's, you know, we're working on like a little festival, kind of like day party, yeah. nightclub DJs at night, comedy during the we're fucking at. day, uh, like Denver. Ooh, I love it, Denver. So like you know, so it's gonna be on the West Coast. 
So we're working with Zia Farms on that. It's going to be a lot of fun. Stay tuned on that. But uh, he just wants you to know, guys know he's taking a little uh, a little moment up to pause, work on the on the, on the uh, live event shit. And he's also sponsoring uh, um, the whole uh, theater at uh, Skate Fest. So guys, Zia Farms, go support them. They're our main sponsor. Shout out to Zia Farms. Take toast. So that's CBD smoke. If DC shitting and coming in my hood right now, it just came all over your cat, dude. <laughs> Yo, bro. <laughs> Bring the cat. Uh, yeah, he's like, yeah, wanna, Bring my son. Baby, bring me. This is what I say to my girlfriend all day. My boy. Bring my son. <laughs> bring, I'm you allergic, can bring him. so I don't want to. Um, Fine. Bring my boy. Yeah. Bring me, boy. Bring bring him. My, my eyes going to pop out. So, I mentioned that I was trying to get my girlfriend pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we produced. <laughs> this guy is I, crazy, I'm not bro. joking. This is what I was all for. <laughs> I mentioned that my girlfriend was pregnant. We officially have a newcomer to the family, <laughs> my little man. <laughs> so this is Jake the dog. Jake, Jake the personality. Jake, this is Jake John the dog. dog. Oh, this is Jake, Jake the, dog. the dog. I love it. You guys are ironic in ways I like. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, my knees are up. You can see him. Hold up. My, this is my Jakey. Shout out Jake the dog. He's he's uh he's the best. How do you? I mean, DC came in and can you reenact what Jake happened? Bro, he was just petting something on the floor for no reason. Dude, oh. you, you, oh. <laughs> DC was just, oh, he was petting something. I felt something nudge went, my and, foot. And then he looked down and he was, <laughs> oh, yeah, petting him for like a minute. <laughs> so, like, I remember that I was know, allergic. You know I want to, um, I hate the stigma around adoption and like how they treat it. Like, what is, like, I remember being a kid, I would say I'm adopted because my mom looked older than all the other parents. Mom's 80 now. Jeez, bro. So. I see why she would threaten to send you guys back, bro. So, yeah, 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 yeah. But she was a strong, you know, whatever. It doesn't matter. But, like, people would, like, look at us like, are you, are you sad? I'm like, bro, I'm trying to figure shit out, bro. I'm yeah, not like, trying to be sad. Yeah, yeah, The fuck you talking about yeah, sad? Yeah. And my mom did a great thing. I was thinking about this shit today. I'm trying to figure out if I'm the first guy that could fuck every single one of his parents. He's talking into the white cloth. <laughs> I was waiting to drink. My bad. I was saying. <laughs> he was saying. <laughs> Anyways, go ahead. The joke is ruined. Bye, um, Jakey. Say bye, Jakey. Bye, Jake. <laughs> Jake the ball. Um, I hate that, like, this is interpretation that, like, we're sad about things. I'm sure there are some sad adopted yeah. kids, right? But this whole but, notion that, like, they no, put on television. To... There was this whole notion put on television yeah. that, like, you can't tell a kid that he's a doctor. Yeah, I know what you mean. The worst thing you could do is wait 15 years later. <laughs> I hate, my mom told me immediately. Right, right. My right. mom, was, like, she Yo, was, you're not I, my son. I never mm. told you this. Yeah, I never told you this. If, um, That's why your personality is messed up. I'm a doctor. No, you're not. <laughs> I found out. What? Like, I, know you're lying. I know you're lying. <laughs> you're definitely lying. That's something you're probably your brothers told you when you were growing my up. My brother would always say that. To my, us. Yeah, my brother would say but that. My mother would always, but my mother was, uh, uh, my brother would tell, he did the same joke to my sister and then me. He would say, by the way, you actually adopted. Your real name is Mocha Chicka Ching Chong. Mocha Chicka Ching Chong. Why did you think of another name? Like, and bro, <laughs> and still to this day, I always wanted to be like, bro, you could have got me. And you just said it was Sam. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yo, Mocha was, Chica, you was chick yo, by the way, American and Chinese. There's some young comics out there, like there's a little bit of knowledge in that. You should not doing too much is doing too much. Like yeah. Yeah. Just, I'm like, bro, say Sam. Like, yeah, you, you could have said anything, bro. Yeah, yeah, Mocha Chica, 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 Chica. Dad's name. Yeah. <laughs> but Sam. um It is where so it's she just blankly was like, Yo, you're not my son. It translates kind of the same. My mom <laughs> And well, she wasn't being mean. She was she just telling you, she like... Was, no, she was, like, listen. Leveling with you. Well, listen, she was also getting stories at the time of... Because, like, the foster parent community is very tight-knit. So... Are they like that? Like a secret society. They, well, it's like... Well, they have to... De they, they depend on each other because, like, it's like, what's going on in your house? And they'd be like, yo, this is what I did to fix that shit. You reference, yo, I just got a new Chinese one. He's seven. Yo, <laughs> I got an Indian. So, you want to... Yo, how's the Indian? You, you can switch. So, <laughs> you're like Pokemon cards. <laughs> why'd you say... It's why'd you say that. Whoa, let's go. Let's why'd you say that? Because shit, in my community, I was like in the... Uh, it was Jefferson Houses, but it was also the adopted homes. Yeah. Because the, the foster care homes. That's what it should have been called. Because, yeah. bro, everybody around us were foster children. What? Because it was like... I. They give, to be a foster mom, per kid, they give you around a, uh, no, a year. 
They give you shit money. They give you like eight hundred a month per kid. Oh, okay, yeah. Right. Okay, so so it's about ten thousand a year per kid, though, right? Something like that. It's like thirty. Thirty. That's what I said. Not <laughs> per kid, but you per kid per year, though. No. Ten thousand around there. Yeah. Okay. So. And, and um, the math is terrible, DC. <laughs> oh, we learned that from the movie. Seven plus eight. You learned that from <laughs> Bro, people have shared that clip so much. People yeah. I don't even know about yo, this clip is Yo, fire. apparently you guys are going to be DP in Lauren Petri. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what's good. We should bring her on the show and ask her her yeah, fucking yeah, bring her on add the it show. up. Yeah. Nah, she just wants to be heard. She just wants to be talk <laughs> shit. None of y'all yo, are tense. Yo, I want to be like, bitch, you're 50. <laughs> yo, by the way, uh, you, you guys don't know this, but I, didn't, we, I, I, I want to say it earlier. Kevin's been talking to riddles all day. <laughs> he just talks like Yoda now. I'm enlightened, Kev. He said, he said, I don't gotta be a 10 in your eyes. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, You talked to her like you were a bad bitch, yeah. and she was some guy trying to get your attention. Yo, you know what I did? She got thick did. fingers, bro. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm trying Yo, to listen to girls fingers. with thick fingers. <laughs> I didn't oh, you know, know what I'm saying? My, uh, my uncle found out he was adopted. Did, well, did he? Uh, by accident. He was like going, like, after my uh, grandfather died. They were going through like his old stuff, and he was like, "Oh, hey, well, guys, I found my baby book. Guys, I found my birth certificate. Who the fuck is Greg?" Oh yeah, my name was shitty. I saw my original oh, what's your birth real certificate. Name? Bro, I ain't saying that shit. Bro. I yeah, come nah, out. wait, no, no, no. stop, yeah, stop, stop. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. The man I've been calling Kevin for seven years now, damn near. You're telling me, <laughs> you are telling me, your name is not Kevin. My my first name is technically not Kevin. What was it? Is is like the I'm not gonna say. No, nah, I want to hear how Latin this shit is, bro. Oh, yeah. I want to hear how Latin it's this shit podcast. is, bro. Oh, this is what our content is. It's yo, bro. Yo, yo, subscribe to the Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> you want to hear Kevin Sanchez's name? Name. What's your name, Papi? <laughs> My original name, right. Raul. So I, I'm gonna give you. Can guess. we guess? It's I'm gotta gonna, be Raul. It's not. It's not. It's, it's not, not guessable. It's not guessable. I remember meeting a Raul in second grade. I was like, that's such a. I don't think you're saying it right. Raul. Raul. Raul, that's the Raul. Name. Every everybody growing up in Florida to New York, every I always knew Spanish kid in Raul, Julio, like always knew a kid. Knew, I, knew, I knew very few Raul, but definitely Angel, Puerto Rican kids love it. I knew more angels. <laughs> actually, I was gonna say and those they, kids were always the worst. They were, bro. bro my best friend, my worst. best friend's, uh, my best friend who was Dominican in high school's name was uh, Ellie Angel. And I follow him. That's his last name. Follow each other. Oh, that's his middle we name. We follow each other. Yeah, we follow each other. Is that his middle name, Ellie Angel? Oh, his whole name yeah, is Ellie. Oh, Angel. by the way, you so, saying it like I a first name was. I know, I know how to say it in, in, um, in um, Dominican. Like, I know how to say it in like. Ellie on head. Ellie on head. Ellie on head. Bro, I used to go over his mom. Bro, hear his mom would say that, and he'd come out to the room, and I was. Uh, I'm the thing. El, by the way, Ellie Angel, shout out. If, I mean, I doubt he's listening, but da- shout out to Ellie Angel because I'm also such a shithead and a little bit of a poker. You guys mm-hmm. know that he was like you. We're like you're crazy, but for some reason our crazy makes you go. I, I'm like calm. Mm-hmm. Where like he, because he was in, he was enlightened. Like he was like, bro, I'm like. I'm like is he an older brother? Is yes. His name yes. means the angel. Is, is that literally his name? So means? no, so bro, he was like a, like a, a very positive, enlightened person. He wanted to rap, but rap and light and loved logic yeah, yeah. and all that shit. Um, so, bro, but that was, I, that's the only time I could ever get him mad. And I would do it just to see him get mad because he, I, um, oh, Ellie and him. Yeah, his mom would go, Ellie, yeah. <laughs> Eliyahe! 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 And then he just go, oh, and get up and go. Something would happen. They'd, the five minutes would go by, he'd come back, and mm-hmm. something like his face would be whatever. And I'd just go, and we'd go back to like, play Mario Kart, and I'd just go, Eliyahe! <laughs> and bro, I swear, there's no time he'd be like, yo, I, I, I'm a swing. Like, they don't like when white people do that. Like, I don't even think it's white. No, I think it is because like it said, like if a white person is always calling a Spanish girl Jessica instead of Jessica, oh, that's annoying. It makes her, you know what I mean? It, it makes her like, what? Oh yeah, you Latins pr- make the, the J's a Y sound, ha ha ha. You yeah. know what I mean? It makes oh, them, like, yeah, it's annoying yeah. to them. Yeah, <laughs> Jessica. You know you're what I right. mean? I'm, ju- I'm not making a voice. Exactly. You're like, yeah. <laughs> you're right. Like, no, I was going wrong. Uh, uh, I, I was going to uh, say, uh, say this. Another thing that was always fun. Another my favorite Ellie Angel moment was one day we were just high as fuck. And we smoke we smoke weed on low line. His mom would make delicious skirt steak with rice and beans and put platanos and mm-hmm. fucking deliciousness. My girl's about to eat that. Really grew up with the money. It's the my girl about to eat that tomorrow. I love that shit so much. My girl about to eat that tomorrow. She's meeting my mom tomorrow. She was like, Oh, oh, okay. Why I met your mom? Because you know you don't want to go to the hood. My mom will leave the apartment. Not, but no, I'm for real. Like this. So most of the times when I tell like you, no, no, most of the time, you know, New York Chicago Cafe, like we're just come through the neighborhoods, chill, 
doesn't you could come see me and you didn't want to come for real though his mom lives in the hood it's like scary. east no no east harlem is like the hood bro <laughs> like it still is to today like, did you go there yeah, I used to go to comedy in Harlem there. I used to live close. I used to go one one twenty fifth and Malcolm X, so I'd walk there sometimes for the train. Why did you put Malcolm X up there? It's the eighties, bro. Because it was um, that's where the Harlem Renaissance was. Okay, um, um, no, no, I was gonna say it depends. Yeah. During the day, it's not that scary. So we just, it's at night. Dude. So we went and smoked some weed, and we just blitzed out of our minds, and came back and we were sitting in his room, and his mom was obviously speaking Spanish, so she goes, "El and just starts Spanish, and I swear my life got strike me dead. I I grew up with a, a nanny, like a babysitter, who was Spanish, mm-hmm. and but like they were like close to the family, and it was like every other day, every okay. other day they were either picking me up, watching me for this long, like for like all of us, like all all the kids, because mm-hmm. like my mom was fucking working, my dad was fucking working, like early on in life. Yeah, yeah. So, like later in life, my mom when she could, she stopped working. Um, so I just would, I swear, I would always remember, she'd be like, we make cereal. She'd be like, ask me, like, say in English. I'd be like, can I get, can I have some cereal, please? Can I have some cereal, please? She'd go, can I ask me in Spanish? And, bah, 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 bah. and I would cross, so I would say in Spanish, like, I would, and we'd go on cruises, and I'd go to other countries, and they'd be like, this kid can talk Spanish? Mm-hmm. And he's like, yeah, man, he's actually, like, you can get through a conversation. And bro, I was high, and in my, my, just like, back of my mind, and I just remember sitting there playing Mario Kart, whatever the fuck we were doing. We were playing Mario, a lot of Mario Kart. We were playing Mario Kart, whatever the fuck we were doing. His mom said whatever shit, and I just went, nah, tell her we want dinner in like 30 minutes. Like, not right now. <laughs> and, he, and he went, I bet. Ha, ba, 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 ba. And he went to playing, and he went, what the fuck? I went, what? He went, you just understood Spanish? And I swear, my, I don't like, if you spoke to me in Spanish, I'm like, I'm not there, I can't do it. But I'm telling you, just like whatever she said, I knew it yeah, enough yeah. where I was like, mm-hmm. and and but like the, I, I can remember feeling the panic of like, no, no, I don't want you right now. We're way too hot. Mm-hmm. I remember feeling, I swear, I'm, I remember feeling that of like, bro, we're way too hot. Mm-hmm. Like, well, like, when you smoke weed, I don't know about that. When I smoke, when I smoke, sometimes I start remembering shit from my childhood of it. That was deep in the crevices. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just pulled that out of my dust them out, dust yeah. it, dust it yeah. out. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, but I was going to say my uncle who found himself. Um, oh, how do you feel about that? He, he, he got resentful. He almost won. He almost like, but yeah. you know why? Because then... I think what, it changed his life a lot. What happens is this. is like you start thinking about your childhood. Like, oh, this makes more sense. Why I was treated this way. Or like, like I knew why we were treated this right way. Like, oh, shit, makes sense. <laughs> like, I knew immediately. Oh, yeah, we're not their blood. We're not their family for real. They could say it all day, but they treat us... They would but know. that's the weird thing about, <clears throat> and it's natural. I but, don't blame them. How old were you when she told you that? Well, she. Here's another thing. They gave my mom, my biological mother, four to five years which was unprecedented to get her life together. Mm-hmm. Right. So, I was visiting my biological mom all the time. Yeah. All the time. No yeah. way. Yeah. Yeah. So and sometimes she would like. We're talking twelve. Younger. Wait, younger wait, than that. Wait. So you. Wait, but, I don't mean to cut anything off. We'll remember this. Mm-hmm. You're not going to dodge this. What the fuck was your original <laughs> name? Yeah, 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 you're right. you fucking right, you crook, bro. You little this fucking, motherfucker. I, I had a super like you, bro. This nigga would always do shit like that. <laughs> hey, bro, when you go fix that, I say, yeah, hey, they're pronto, no, it's a coffee, they're going to make food, and all this shit, you start talking about shit. I don't know how we got off of it. Yeah. Buddy, what was your original name? We're almost at the end of the podcast. Kev, right. was it Juan Carlos, Kev? No. What was it? I wanted to be something so good and original and Dominican, well, Kevin's already, Kevin is a white name, not a white it's name. It's an Irish name. Oh, yeah, I'm saying. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank Kevin. You. Mm-hmm. So my, R- Rocky's name is really Rocky. Really? Morocco, right? Rocky. Okay. It was Rocky. So Rocky. Like all the Straight up Rocky. Rocky. Yeah. Not Rocky. Like, what's nothing. the last name? So, say the last name first. Uh, the, the original last name? Then. T-H-E-N. Then. Yo, stop! Yo, <laughs> Kevin, stop, bro. Yo, 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 why is your past bro, family's last bro, name past bro. tense like your family? Bro, yo, I can't. Crazy, like bro. your family. I don't know what? this guy at all, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you were talking about this? <laughs> yo, I, I try to, I try to do it. Do what I just said. I, I, I try to do it, but, um... <laughs> I, now I can do it because I get more time on stage. I just haven't gotten to it, but... Okay. Because there's a lot of shit to explain, you know? Wait, ready? But it's 59 minutes on an hour dot. Kev. Wait, so 
I got a story. I was gonna say, what's the first name? So I got you. Okay. So my 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 sisters, my not my adopted like I'm adopted, so my foster sister, there we go, that's a better way of saying it. My foster sister husband used to always say my name weird. I was like, yo, how come it's so hard for this guy who knows English to say Kevin? But he never really liked us. What did he say? He would call me Kelvin. And I used to look at him like, yo, I hated it too. <laughs> I hated it. And then I saw my original birth certificate and it said Kelby. K E L V I. And I was like, <laughs> disgusting. But this is why. Because in Dominican. Kevin, did you name yourself? Because in Dominican households, she wanted me to be named Kevin, but she didn't know how to spell it. Kevin. So Kevin. 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 And they thought it was an L in the Kevin. Yo. <laughs> Yo, Kevin, did you. K -E what? Wait, K E L B A. K E L B A. K E L B A. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Remember when you said the thing about making an accent? Yeah. And like, it's like, it's like racist because you're saying, you're saying it with a Y? It's like, yeah, you guys. She spelt that way phonetically. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Kevin? Kevin. Kevin. Wait. So, Kevin, did Kelvin. you give yourself your name? Kevin? No, my, okay. no. So, what happens is, I don't know how this happens. Great question. That's a great question. Yeah. And I don't know who. I thought like, you did. By the way, you, when you do the bit on stage, you just say, so I gave myself, I, I named myself. No, this is even funnier. What happened? <laughs> So in the process, I remember the, in the process of actually getting adopted, people were calling me Kevin, except for this one asshole. Kevin. Right? It was, everyone was calling me Kevin. Something happened in the paperwork where somebody looked at our names and was like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> 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 Yo, yours is just letters together. Yours is just letters together. Yeah, they were like, I think she's trying to say, get, get. I could imagine this guy go, get, get. And then on my... Fixed birth certificate, not my original one. It says Kevin. Do you have the original? Uh, uh, it's somewhere. I don't know where though. I need a picture of it. I gotta find it, bro. It's, so I don't cool. know where it's at. Kevin. And uh, um, like Rocky, they spelled it. R -O -C -K -I -E. Oh my god, bro. R O Y C K I E. Yeah, Royke. <laughs> my guy, Royke. Royke. <laughs> Bro, son, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, bro. It's, it's like wow. she sent y'all to Puerto. It's like Puerto Ricans get better education, and like, yeah, they just yeah. <laughs> they just fixed it. Puerto Ricans, are, they're not as fun as Dominicans. They're smarter. They're definitely smarter, bro. Yeah. They definitely. Yeah. Well, they at least they don't ask somebody who knows English. Yeah, they be like, "How do you spell? Mm -hmm. How do you spell Kevin? 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 Is this? And he goes, there's the B. What the B? <laughs> And then they just start changing the old. Be stupid. I had B. <laughs> I don't know. Kevin. Oh my God. Be stupid. Bro. I had B. Oh, um, you got the funniest life, bro. Yeah, like, it's life has been crazy. So, we're at the hour mark, and yeah. um, I actually have a great idea. What's up? So, I think, and I'll put it on the TV. I think we should do uh, us watching the CFC, me versus DC. Oh my god. Oh, I'm about to sweat, bro. Because I have <laughs> never seen it. Never I watched it once. It. I didn't know it was on YouTube like four years ago, and I watched it. I was like, Jesus. The comments are, I was like, damn, this shit got 100,000 views or something. I, it, you, I have a thousand. No, really? A hundred thousand. I swear to God, <laughs> bro. I swear, I'm looking up right now. Look it up. <laughs> We're going to watch it, yeah. I mean, it's easy. <laughs> okay. Yeah. But this was a fun episode. Cause but guys, this has been a really fun episode. This, this is going to be called... Uh, Kevin's Therapy Kevin's Session. Therapy. No, 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 no. no, no, no. no. Enlighten Kev. Enlighten... No. Okay. Enlighten Kev doesn't nah, get clicks. No, no, no. It's, it's going to be called Enlighten Kelvin. <laughs> Enlighten Kelvin. <laughs> yeah, Kelvin. Can we... But you got to click Kelvin for your page. Oh, my God, bro. You got to put Kelvin on your page. That's so funny. That's guys, so thank wild. you for watching Dope Duck Comedy. The... Sunday morning smoke show. show. Guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, go follow at Dope Dope Comedy and support <laughs> everything that we do. And if you go on to watch me and DC, and if you don't know, let me tell you don't know. Me and DC, when I first got hired at Gas Digital. This is the first time we met time. everyone at Gas. Yep, uh, this is the worst way. Uh, Zach Amico, who was on the podcast a couple weeks ago, hated me for two years. Two, <laughs> I some forgot solid he was a two judge, years. Bro. And uh, him and Chris Fager were judges. Fager... <laughs> Knew who DC was, and me and him were kind of like becoming slow friends, whatever. Um, but it was, it's one of the worst first impressions you'll ever see. And, uh, and then uh, a first impression took two years to get over. 
Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty yeah. sure it ended his relationship. Yo, Dylan hated me, I'm pretty sure, for like a year, bro. Yeah. Because he would come back with tales. I'm just like, damn, bro, they really treat him like shit, I think. And I didn't help. They already treated him like shit at gas, and it didn't help after that oh. shit, bro. I thought y'all were going to kill it. I was like, I was literally. I, like, really thought y'all I, 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 by the way, I was like, I was like, I'm getting hazed because I'm a new guy yeah. that's respectable, and, like, and, I'm, and I told him I want to be a comic. I get it, I understand it. Me and DC are gonna show them that I, my, my, me and my clique are dope and, and cool. And then DC pour gasoline and then, on that. And then shit. DC run and ruin the battle. If you want to see it, I, 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 we'll talk about it. I hate everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys. Peace. Did she shut off at one? What? Oh, dude, we gotta re-record the last thirty minutes. No, at one point fifty one. Yo, yo, you remember? Well, it's on the, it'll be on the camera. <laughs> <laughs> it'll be on the camera audio. It'll be on the camera audio. Uh, so, uh, I, I just noticed the thing maybe died for a second, but regardless of where it stopped. Guys, go watch uh, me and DC's CFC uh, battle on Patreon. You can literally cost $5 to go watch it. Go watch $5 to watch me react to my most cringy moment. Or mm. And um, we're going to be going through all my cringy moments clipped on the Real Ass Podcast page and stuff on this Patreon. So, guys, if you want to see that, please go, sub- go subscribe to the Patreon at Doped Up Comedy to watch Dylan Negri, DC Williams, Kevin Sanchez watch my cringiest moments on Real Ass Podcast and mm-hmm. CFC and other things at Gas Station. Oh, that'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, we're doing it right now. Oh, that'd be cool. On Patreon. Only $5. See you there.